you're watching Expected Score channel and this is our free training course XGLearn. In this course we will show you step by step how to make value bets using advanced football metric expected goals XG. We recommend you to watch all the lessons in this course to make clear all about the XG. And what is the most important you will clear how to use XG in sports betting. In the first lesson we explain why bettors who use XG have the advantage over the players using traditional football stats. So let's compare them to find the reason why XG is such a powerful tool for football analysis. What is the main difference between XG stats and traditional football stats? Traditional stats count the number of shots. XG stats calculate the quality of shots that a team takes. So at this point we have rather different approaches. Traditional football stats counts the number of shots and considers each shot as a unit. All the shots are equal for traditional football stats. Even if it's 10 shots outside the box, far from the goal line, or 10 shots from the box, close to the goal line. XG statistics is quite another. XG not just records the fact of a shot, it calculates the probability to score a goal for each of those shots. Let's analyze several shots for you to understand the whole power of XG statistics. As you can see, in this video a player from the second Japanese league makes a shot from the long distance. Also, there is a defensive wall in the front of the player. Those kind of shots have very low value. They could be converted in a goal only once per 100 shots. Then the other player instantly makes one more shot. And we can see the same situation. The long distance and defensive players that can block the shot display the same low probability to score a goal. Now let's check the information that give us the traditional method. Traditional stats recorded in total only two shots, because it counts the number of shots and considers each shot as a unit. Now you can clearly see the difference. Let's watch one more shot. In this video, the player from Icelandic Football League scored a goal from the few meters. This kind of shots ends with a goal in almost 100%. But traditional statistics doesn't care about distance and other stuff. It equates this shot to the shots from the previous video. As you can see, the main problem of traditional statistics is that traditional stats equates all the shots. Each shot in traditional stats is recorded just as one unit. What can XG statistics show us in this situation? XG calculates the probability for all those shots to end up with a goal. For example, the first and the second shots evaluated as 0.01 XG. It means those shots end up in a goal once per 100 attempts. The probability of the third shot is valued as 0.97 XG. It means this shot ends in a goal in 97 cases per 100 attempts. So in those examples you can see that the approaches of traditional shots and expected goals metric are completely different. For traditional statistics those three shots are equal and have the same value. Each shot is just a number for traditional stats. XG statistics works differently. It makes a power rank for all the shots and gives the probability to score a goal for each shot. In our examples it's only 1% for the first two shots and almost 100% probability to score a goal for the third shot. I hope you're convinced that expected goals is a powerful tool for sports betting. It calculates the quality of shots instead of numbers, which calculates traditional stats. Expected goals helps to evaluate the power ranking of a team. How it reacts on the score changing. Which team plays better taking the lead. And which team plays better when the opposite team has the lead. Which team makes most dangerous shots from the start. And which one makes them at the end of the match. 
and a lot of another important information. XG Statistics is the new undiscovered world that opens a lot of opportunities for sport bettors. In new video, we are going to explain how the expected score website calculates the probabilities for each shot. Also, you will know how to use this information to earn with sports betting.